All right, uh, this is a short tutorial on how to work with um, team projects inside of GitHub. I went ahead and created it because I found the interface to be pretty confusing. There's a lot of different steps that you have to go through, and it, it's not exactly obvious uh, uh, how to work with it. So uh, hopefully by the end of this tutorial, you'll, you'll know how to be part of a, a group project. So the first thing you're going to do is um, you're going to paste the invitation from whatever the assignment is into your browser. And it should give you a page that looks something like this. Uh, as before, you're going to accept the project. What's a little bit new about this is that um, there can be team projects. And so uh, one of the members of your team, uh, you may want to do this while you're sitting down together, but one of the members of your team needs to create a team name. The name is not particularly important. It's just the name has to be unique. So I could call it, um, you know, Team Triton. 2017 or something like that. So once you've created this team, then uh, it's actually um, done two different things at the same time. So well, the first thing it did is it, it cloned the starter code into uh, my repository, and it has um, also created this, this team called Team Triton 2017. So now if I were to, to click on the assignment, I see all of the different starter code um, like it would be for a, a typical project. Okay, as the second user, uh, your, your teammate is going to go in and put in the same invitation, and they're going to get uh, the ability to accept the project as well, except that this time they're going to actually be able to see a list of the different teams that are already created. And so here's this Team Triton 2017. Um, and if you hover your mouse over the, uh, uh, the icons, you can actually see who's, who's on the team or not. So you'd have to communicate the team name to your, to your partner. You hit join. And then um, once you do that, it will actually create now a, uh, a repository uh, that, we, that both team members would, would, would both have access to. And so I believe if you went into settings here, look at your, your teammates, you could actually see that... Um, you now have two team members that are that are part of your project and so you can use that to submit your assignment. 